Hello, my name's Kirk A. Ventiquatro. I am the former lacrosse coach at Carthage High School. I was fortunate enough to coach the Powell Brothers. Uh, through the Powell Brothers, I got to know Coach Simmons and uh, became a big fan of not only Syracuse lacrosse, but of Coach Simmons himself. Coach, I love you, man. You're the best. I just wanted to relay a story about um, one of the first times I heard Coach speak. And he wanted to give a talk to a lacrosse camp. We were arraigned indoors. It was All-American Lacrosse Camp. Uh, I believe it was at Hamilton College. And I'm laying there on the, on the tartan surface. And Coach shows up. And I'm like, perked right up, man. This is Coach Simmons. He's a legend. Well, Coach opened up with a joke that I've told lots of times. And always giving you credit, Coach. And uh, it also uh, morphed into something that I speak about whenever I'm traveling the country with uh, Ryan and uh, Rhino Lacrosse. Anyway, Coach, you talked about the game, the football game between the insects and the animals. The insects were in trouble from the coin toss. They lost that. They kick off, and the cheetah runs it back for a touchdown. Out comes the hippopotamus. He holds for the, the, uh, the uh, elephant, and the elephant kicks. Good. It's good. Down seven to nothing. It was 99 to nothing at halftime. The insects were getting squashed, if you will. And uh, so anyway, big inspirational talk by the uh, the head coach of the insects. He said, okay, boys, in the second half, let's go get them. And they run out of the locker room. Well, in the second half, the game turns around. All of a sudden, the insects are getting back in the game. And the animal coach is like, hey, what's going on out there? He asked the assistant coach, hey, man, what's, what's happening? This isn't anything like in the first half. He says, coach, I don't know. A couple more great things happen. The score gets closer and closer, and he turns to the lion. He says, Lion, what's going on out there? He said, Coach, there's a uh, centipede out there, and he's killing us. A centipede? I don't remember a centipede. Big play happens. Coach calls timeout, goes out on the field, and this is the part that I always had to live here. And uh, the coach is sorting out the pile, grabbing animals and insects. On the bottom of the pile is a centipede looking up. I like how I twiddle my thumbs here, Coach. I had that. And he said, Coach, the centipede. You're killing us. Where were you in the first half? The centipede said, I was getting my ankles taped. Oh, man, but that was awesome. And then, Coach, you went on to talk about always being ready and uh, and so on. So I took that to the next level myself, and I talk to kids all the time about uh, their five minutes because that's about all they're going to be seen uh, before a coach decides to continue to pursue them or they're not for me. So anyway, Coach, thank you for that. I appreciate it. Uh, Ryan, thanks for having me, and thanks for honoring a legend, Coach Simmons.